All right, we're going to rig some special movements using a biped. Um, I'm not going to take the time to skin this, just so I can show you how to load up movement files. So I've got our standard biped, and we're going to come over to our motion tab. And in our motion tab, we have uh, several different things we can do. In other tutorials, we've looked at how to make this biped walk, things of that sort. Uh, this time what we're going to do is we're going to go to our footstep mode, we're going to go to load file and I'm going to go load some files in here and these particular files are actually 3D Max biped motion files. Uh, I've got a, a list of them that we can use. So for instance we'll pick uh, run Oops. And we're going to have this guy um, sprint. And I just click on our file, click open, um, say OK to these things. And you'll notice the biped shifts. And he's got pre-made footsteps out here. And at this point, you can see that all we need to do is click play and our guys in motion. If we want to change our file, all we do is click on this load again. We select a different file, so this time we'll select the gymnastics. Uh, we'll have him do a cartwheel. Click OK. Again, we'll have to adjust our zoom click play and our guy's ready to go. Uh, if this were skinned properly it would actually the skin would move with the bones on this. So at this point if I want to actually put a skin on this guy we're going to turn off the footstep mode, turn on the figure mode. Notice he snaps back to our center position. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and import uh, the standard figure from Mudbox real quick. Okay, I've got our figure moved in. I'm going to scale him down so that he matches my biped. I'm going to move my biped, adjust him. I'm not taking a whole lot of time to do this. I just want to get it close. And that should be close enough. So we'll select our skin. We'll skin this guy. Add our bones. Make sure that you expand all bones. Make sure you do not get this biped one. Start with the pelvis. Go all the way down. Select. And we'll come back over to our movement tool, select our biped, go back to our footstep mode, click play again. And we have some envelopes to adjust here.